But guys, welcome back to episode two of the series. We're going to go through the recruiting for Oklahoma State. That first season was a major success. I think we finished off. Um, we did ten and three, uh, ten and two regular season. I believe we lost our conference game. But we are going to go into recruitment, and as you can see. We are down a lot of players. <laughs> We're going to have to work on some definite recruits. I don't want to go too crazy on a quarterback, but we do need a good quarterback to sustain our um, our spread offense. And it looks like the top three, he's got a four-star accuracy. Um, these guys are actually pretty evenly matched across the board. So we're going to go with the cheaper of the three, and we're going to take four-star Howard Johnston uh, for a quarterback. Now, wide receiver. This is very difficult. Um, we need very, very speedy wide receivers that can show their blockers. But we need very aware wide receivers. And this guy's got a four-star speed and a four-star awareness. So we're going to take him. Looks like three-star. Three-star speed. Four-star speed, five-star awareness. Definitely going to go with him. Uh, we got two-star wide receivers. We're, we're going to go a little lower. Hopefully get some get uh, a decent three-star. He's got a two-star speed. He's got a three-star speed and a five-star awareness. And that's a three-star. So we definitely are going to go with him. And maybe get another decent three-star wide receiver. It's three-star, one-star awareness. Four-star, two-star awareness. Three-star, one-star awareness. Two and two. We'll go with we'll go with uh, Deshaun Robbins. All right, I'm gonna need a decent offensive line, especially for the pass block. He's got a three awareness, uh, now four on his uh, pass blocks. So definitely going to take him. 98 with a three on pass block, three on awareness. We'll go ahead and go with that because we need to save a little money. Three and one, three and five, four and three, four and two. So we're going to go with this three and five right here. Now we're going to go down to the three star, see if we can't make a break. A three and a two. Three, two. Two, four on awareness. You know what? We'll pick you up. We'll pick you up. Save some money. Defensive lineman. There's only one five star defensive lineman in this whole draft. He's really, he shouldn't even be a five star. We're not going to go with the five star. We are actually going to take um, we're going to take Andre Preston, and then we're going to go down, pick up a three star. Uh, he seems pretty decent, so we'll pick him up. Man, we got a lot of fill to do. I don't think we're going to be able to do it, so we're just going to pick up a couple cheap. Linebackers here. Um, definitely going to have to pick up a cornerback. He's got a one awareness and three coverage. That's horrible for a running back. Two coverage, two speed, one tackling. We'll take that. Uh, we need a kicker. If we could buy a kicker for... We're going to definitely take that. Three-star kicker. Any other players that we can secure with one dollar? This looks like there's a couple of defensive linemen, a linebacker, safety. But we'll take we'll take a two star cornerback. Oh, we can also buy for zero and buy a two star wide receiver for zero. So we're actually gonna take all that. Um we're in need of one linebacker, one safety. They'll pick them up as walk ons. Go ahead and see how we did. Ooh, 25th, so that's not bad. It's not bad. We're expected to go 8-4, and four, just finish 16th. Uh, looks like our offense is going to drop a bit. That's okay. Uh, that's a fresh recruit, and it looks like we recruited a whole lot of freshmen, so this team is going to be a very, very different team than it was last year. 
Yeah, it looks like most of this team is sophomores and freshmen right now. Our wide receivers have one more year, so hopefully we can break in these new wide receivers before they go. But yeah, this is going to be a totally different squad from last year. Also, I would like to go in here and go to settings, uh, game editor. I want to take some of these teams. Like, I don't know who College Station is supposed to mimic, but it's a, uh, it's a South uh, SEC team. Um, I think Nashville is Vanderbilt. We're going to fix some of these. I don't know what the thing is, so I'm just going to put Van. Update. Go back. Um, history and settings. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna fix some of these teams that we know the actual name of. Texas IT is supposed to be Texas Tech. Texas Tech. Oh, um. Let's go TTU, Texas Tech University. We'll update that. Um, I don't know who Fort Worth is, and I don't know who Waco is. Pacific, Washington State, Southern Cal, Utah, Arizona, Pasadena. Now, I think this is supposed to be USF, or uh, UCF, University of... I think it's U USC. That's who this is supposed to be. I think that's who that's supposed to be in the Pacific. Um, no, that's not supposed to be because that's Southern Cal up there. I'm not sure who that's supposed to be. And I don't remember what they were just called. Pasadena. Oh, gosh darn it. So leave that alone. Great Lakes. As a Michigan fan, I should know who these teams are, but I really don't. I don't care. Um, Chicago, I think, is the only one that's out of place in New Jersey, but I don't know either of those. But now the Atlantic. I know that South Carolina Tech is supposed to be Clemson. But I definitely know that's supposed to be Clemson. So we're going to change the name for that for to Clemson. Update. And then I don't know who else any of the teams in here are supposed to be. We got Louisville, Virginia Poly. I think it might be Virginia Tech. Georgia IT. I think that might also be Georgia Tech. But I'm not entirely sure. Actually, I know this has to be Virginia Tech. We're going to change this to VTEC, Virginia Tech. I know that's got to be Virginia Tech. Um, and I think this is Georgia Tech, but we'll leave that alone. Um, Patriot, Central Florida, South Florida, Cincinnati, Houston, Memphis, Dallas. Don't know who Dallas is. Don't know who Philly is. All the other ones look normal. But we are going to go to Independent because I do know that South Bend is most definitely... Notre Dame. I'm going to change those names. And then we'll go back. But yeah, so we're going to fix all that stuff up a little bit. Um, let's do a recap. Records from last year.
League history. Coach database. Bama, of course, won the national championship. We got head coach of the year. I was actually nominated 16th to get that, but whatever. Conference head coach of the year. Oklahoma got that last year. I think you can actually go directly to just your coach with not league history, but the team history. So we would go 11-3, and lost the conference championship, but we did win our bowl game against Boise. Um, I believe we didn't set any records for last year. National records. But I do believe for the team... Um, these will set all the records because it starts for 2019. And we did actually uh, average 452 yards a game, held our opponents under 300. And our quarterback had 33 touchdowns, 23 picks, but he had almost 4,000 yards. So that's not too bad. Um, that's not too bad. We'll take it for what it is. But that's going to wrap up this video. This is just a short video to do the um, recruiting, and I wanted to change the names. I think from here on out, we'll go ahead and do the season and then the recruiting and then the start of the next season will be a full episode. But anyways, as always, it's been your boy LTS Dirty Money signing off. Salute.